Hi there everyone, it is time to check out the Montenegrin, do you say that? The, the entry from Montenegro in this year's Eurovision, and uh, I don't really have much to say before this one, so uh, let's just get right into it. I think I'm going to lower the volume a little bit. Okay. A lot of things going on here. Okay. This... Okay. His voice sounds a bit like... Like these voices you used to hear like 10 years ago or so. I haven't heard a voice like that for quite a while. There's a lot of things going on in the instrumental here. What is this thing that just pops up in the right ear all the time? Liking his voice a lot. I liked his voice. Quite good. I guess this is the chorus? The music isn't really giving off the impression that this is the chorus. Like the music... What is the music doing, even? Well, that was... <laughs> abrupt. <laughs> this is cool. What is this instrument? I'm liking that. Gives quite a foreign, exotic vibe to the song. Good flow into this verse here. The music is so chaotic, though. There's this bass line that just kind of lies in there. Contrasting the beat. There's some flute going on in the left ear. It's quite a chaotic instrumental going on here. I'm not quite able to keep up with what's going on in the song. Okay. Alright, it becomes a bit more poignant as a chorus here. I'm liking how they work with their harmonies, how they work along together with the vocals. It's quite an inviting feeling all over this. But the music really needs to be more cohesive. Okay. Like, there are so many harmonies in here that there is not really a need for the, for the instruments to also har make harmonies on each other. I think that they should have focused more on this instrument here to keep, keep the whole thing going. Okay, a nice little note there at the ending with the harmonies going all together. Okay, um, well, <laughs> what did I just listen to? I think there are some positives in this one. It, it's quite uh, warm, charming, inviting, welcoming. I think that they can, if they can perform it well, um, they could create a pretty good atmosphere on stage. And they could actually make the melody stand out. Like, you, you could actually focus on the melody when you see them live, because that's what's going to be the main focus. But now as I listen to this, and when you're going to listen to the studio version, I think that <laughs> this vocal melody is not going to be what's actually going to stand out here because the music is just is just so much <laughs> there there are things going on absolutely everywhere and all the time in the music here you kind of got that hint it, it, like even the intro you got these these 5 seconds there in the beginning you just heard all these sounds um contrasting each other and it was quite just like uh <laughs> quite odd to listen to um the First verse f felt quite simple. It wasn't too much uh, as the rest of the song was going to be because uh, the first verse was quite easy to just follow, uh, enjoy the vocals, and uh, yeah, I could actually focus on the vocals in that part. But then all of these sounds just started coming in and building on each other, uh, contrasting each other, building harmonies on top of each other, and everything just became this, became this big cluster of sounds and I really couldn't keep up anymore. Uh, this I don't think I've ever heard a song like this one before. It, it's like 
what this one does differently than most of the songs this year is that I think they do too much. Um, there are a lot of songs in this selection that that I feel could have more variation in them. This one has just gone overboard with the variation because there are so many different sounds, so many different melodies that they just stack on top of each other and they contrast each other with such a weird uh, collective sound. And I feel like th this song has been so heavily compressed that these all of these sounds with their dynamics has been pushed, <laughs> like been minimalized, what do you call it, Min minimized? I don't know. They've just been compressed into this flat little uh, square of just sounds shooting from everywhere and going into each other, clashing in the frequencies. It's just quite confusing to listen to. That, that's really the thing I'm taking out of this one. Um, I, I would just straight up call it a mess, but I mean, there are some ideas in here that, that are actually quite promising, but the execution of this, like the, the music is just, is just weird. And it's not, I, I'm not going to be able to, to get a grip on what is actually going on here because there are just sounds everywhere. There's this flute in the left ear and then the, the bass is going in the right ear. The kick is just keeps going and going and then they do harmonies on the vocals and <laughs> it's just too much for me i'm sorry but yeah maybe there are some of you out there who actually love this and i would love to hear from you uh also those of you who might not love it i'd like to hear from you as well uh other than that yeah just tell me what you think of this song in the comments and uh i will see you all next time take care of yourselves until then and uh bye bye